morning. It's me, Mikey Pipes. Thanks for tuning in to this video today. Today is Tuesday, July 26th, 2022. We're going to do three Fujitsu ductless mini split systems on this house. We're in a split level house in Woodmere. Top floor gets hot in the summer months and a little bit chilly in the winter. So what, nothing else better than a Fujitsu mini split system. Actually, it's probably one thing, but that'd be a Bosch, but I don't know, Bosch, you listening? Send me some samples. <laughs> All right, so in this bedroom, we're gonna utilize this condensate pump for a ductless system. This is made by Diversitech. It did not come with a manual in the box. I don't know why. So I went online, I printed it. And right now we have Daniel. He's figuring out how to install it. This unit is gonna go right there. And then we're gonna run the line set and the control wire and the discharge tubing from the pump up into the attic across and then down on the other outside wall. And there's one in that master bedroom who's waiting for the, the housewife to finish her time in the shower. Unless, Chris, what do you think? Maybe we should go in there and like give her a little, uh, little once over. I don't know. Sure. Welcome back, Chris. As you've been away for about a week. If you remember, he was at the gym last week and the guy made a comment on the size of his male appendage. And next thing you know, his back was broken and it was laid up. <laughs> Details on the Mikey Pipes Uncensored channel. Check it out. It's called Mikey Pipes Uncensored, where I keep it unfiltered. Uncensored, raw, uncut, unedited. Ain't that right, Air Force Nun? Yeah, that's true. And by the way, it's Air Force Nun, N O N E, not N U N. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> not All right, let's get the show on the road because it's already 8 19 and we need to make some moves. Here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're outside and that hole I'm going to utilize for that other bedroom with the condensate pump. And this one is for that first bedroom I showed you. And. In my last video, I was looking for this and it was buried in the truck. This is by Rector Seal and this is the spin, right? Or the Pro Fit. We're gonna use this to create our flares on our 3 8 and quarter inch. Now this set comes with quarter, 3 8 half, three, eight, three, five eighths and three quarter. Okay, and it slips onto a drill. You can use an impact driver if you wanted to, like we're going to, and here is my quarter inch, okay? And there's my three eighths. So the first thing we're gonna do, Chris, cut off the end of that three eighths copper line set. And I'm gonna go up there, I'm gonna grab uh, the nuts, the three eighths and the quarter inch. Okay. We're gonna use the spin. One bad thing about this, it gets, it gets the pipe very hot, but watch how we do it. Harrison, here is the NAVAC. Let's just line that up where it needs to go, right there. Let's grab this neat little tool. Let's shove that in there. Let's close that, let's push the button. Actually, I didn't even push the button and it did it. I think that looks much better. Don't focus. There it is. All right, let's do the quarter inch again. Okay. Ooh, that wouldn't have been cool. Budge. And to compare, I think that's far superior. 
What do you think? I think, I think the machine does it better. So this is what I'm gonna do for the guys, all right? I have, this was used a couple times. I have this Rector Seal spin. And if you would like to win this, email me, mike at mikeypipes.com. A meaningful email on why I should give this to you, and I'm gonna pick the best winner, I'm gonna mail it to you. Okay, this was used maybe for, I don't know, a dozen systems or so, but I love this. This is tits, and we only do tits work. A drawback I see with this is copper fatigue. You heat up that pipe, you're causing extra stress on it, and I don't think it's good for the copper. But I think the folk that Rexer seal wouldn't want to hear that, but it's all good. All right, damn, you got a... <laughs> Why does your, uh, your bum look so big? <laughs> All right, we got Air Force Nun going up the ladder. And you can put that down. You don't need to hold that. It's not a union job. Air Force Nun is going to connect the 3 eighths and the quarter inch, the flare connections. He's going to torque that to around 18 pounds of pressure with his torque wrench. I mean, his torque bicep. Ain't that right, Air Force it's, Nun? It's uh, good tight. Good and tight, exactly. <laughs> so this is for that first bedroom. We're gonna run these two down here, and then we're gonna send Air Force Nun into the attic, or maybe send Peter Pan into the attic. I'm sorry, Peter into the attic. And we're gonna send him the control wire. We need some 3 8 clear tubing. All right, get a roll 3 8 clear tubing. Uh, control wire, a quarter inch, 3 8 through that hole across the uh, ceiling of the bedroom here and down to the closet in the other one while Daniel drills a hole for the past 20 minutes. And it's 9.05. No, it's all good. All right, time to mount the condenser. I just drilled two, four, six holes with the Milwaukee rotary hammer with the bit. We're gonna put the wall mount bracket on. The wall mount brackets that I order come with these bolts. So there's Five. I thought it had six. I may have an extra one in the truck. Oh, there we go. Right there, Peter. Grab that one right there. Okay, we're gonna go put this in. You ready? Yep. All right, All right. we got the first one in. Here, do this one here. Okay. Easy peasy. Okay, working on that line set there. We're using the 100 millimeter covers by Slim Duck by Inaba Denko. Inaba Denko. This is the overseas model design in Japan, but it's made in Vietnam. Go figure that out. All right, he's gonna come across the top of that window, down and across, and yes, I'm above the header there because it's on an angle, by the way. We're gonna come down, we're gonna put an elbow right there. We're gonna go across to here. That's already done. Coming down here, there is the Fujitsu. This is the 24,000 BTU, three zone or triple. You know you gotta put a little thing there, right? You're not just put- I'm doing it so I don't get fused. So you don't get, oh, confused, okay. Very good, 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 good. So, Connecting our line sets. And once those two are connected, we can technically start pumping down. Yeah. All right, we're gonna work on power. We're gonna run power here today. I drilled a hole there. We're gonna make that a little bit bigger. I'm gonna put my disconnect right there so it'll cover up that nasty hole that I made. And we're gonna run a circuit from the main panel, 200 amp pounds directly on the other side of this meter. We'll put a disconnect there, the whip. We'll make our whip and hook up to our power L1, L2 and we should be good to go hopefully before maybe 12 31 o'clock all right while peter's working on the line set I, just, I happen to be a magnet for fur coats and take a look at this one <laughs> take a look at the fur coat on this goodman oh my god look at that it's crazy 
absolutely crazy. How is this thing even marginally efficient? That's insane. Absolutely insane. This is the neighbor's system for 10A, I think. Absolutely insane. I be, I'm just like a magnet for fur coats. I think Daniel's a magnet too. You're a magnet for fur coats, no? Really? I just, is it just me? I guess so. Damn. But if you tell me, like you told me uh, you're going to go to someone that hasn't had a cleaning in a few years, see if they need it, and every time you say that, then it's a perk <laughs> I have just the, a special, I don't know, I have a special power where I get attracted to fur coats. Like the lady whose husband just died, she had the flood in her house. She has the nice carrier. Oh, I don't recall, but... Yeah, I made a video for her. First. Oh, her, yes. She had the flood in the house. Yeah, I hear you. The carrier, the, uh, that was one of the first Infinity systems that we installed. And I did that before Bosch. I knew about Bosch, but... Every time I go there, it's like the whole world is ending. Yeah, it is. So Bosch now makes, I think, an IDS 1.5. It's a cheap... Or oh, maybe it's, it's in between the, the Bova, the original ones... And now the, the two the two point so they make a cheaper version with similar capabilities, but it's a little bit cheaper. I saw that in email yesterday. Give a shout out to Bosch, the people at Bosch Thermal Technology. Thanks for being a corporate sponsor of the Mikey Pipes YouTube channel. Really appreciate it. And guys, let me get down in the script in the um, comment section down below. Let me get a hashtag love Bosch while we work on this Fujitsu. Maybe the next one it'll be a Bosch. You never know. Boss, you listening? Let's go, Boss. All right. Daniel's working on the the last of the two zones off the front of the house. Isn't that so nice? It is. I love it. I wonder who's going to get the spin. <laughs> uh, Matt. Matt. What's his name on YouTube? He doesn't have YouTube. How does he watch the channel? Oh, he just watches without signing in. So that means he's not a subscriber. Oh, maybe he does. I don't know if he has a name or not. Using the Nylog. Very nice. Someone commented on the Fujitsu install that we did last week that they had a problem with a Mitsubishi. And the Mitsubishi rep came out and saw the Nylog and it says, I can't help you. Yeah. Yeah. That's the reason why I installed Fujitsu. The guy at the Fujitsu said he doesn't like it either. Really? Yeah. But he says it doesn't, doesn't mean you can't use it. Yeah, that's true. You know why they don't they don't they don't like it because it's it's not applied properly. If you apply the nylog property, pro property, property, properly, it works well. Very nice. And then once he's done with that, I'll finish drilling that hole, mount the disconnect, do line voltage, wire this. Peter's working on that one. We're gonna bring this across to here and it's 10 to 11 not bad not too shabby hopefully that condensate pump works that we put in <laughs> i hope so too i hope so too hashtag let's go bosch maybe the next one will be a bosch duckless you never know you never know all right it is 11 40 in the morning i just finished a union smoke break let's go see what the guys are doing all right I'm not using the DJI uh, gyroscope thingy. I'm just using my regular iPhone 11, filming in 4K at 60 frames per second. You're gonna notice something a little different on this install. We're using the liquid tight to actually protect the communication lines, All right? We don't. I don't normally do that, but I did. Just did my electric or my disconnect to the unit. I was telling Daniel, like, Daniel, it would be nice. Like, maybe we just cover these lines with some liquid tight to protect it. And he goes, you want me to do it? And I was like, you want to do it? He goes, he goes, yeah, why not? And then as he's doing it, he's like, man, this is going to look tits. He actually said tits, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he didn't say tits on camera, but it looks tits. We got one more line because this is the triple. All right, that's that. The uh, Air Force Nun and Peter. By the way, Peter's been getting more hands-on in the last couple weeks. You know, he's earning that money. Earning that money. Listen, you keep it up, you make it another raise in six months. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Come on, you can't get back-to-back -back raises. 
You know, you got to wait a while now. So we got both ladders up there. They did the nice line hide right there, the line set covers. Coming across to here and then down. So we're already vacuuming down circuits. Are you doing both at the same time? Yeah. Maybe that's a problem. What, what, what micron are we at so far? Blank. Blank. Zero. We're at zero, we're at zero microns. microns. <laughs> it has to figure it out for a second. It has to figure it out. We're at three. Oh, man. It's only four. 45 and slowly dropping. But let's take a look at the electric that we're doing here. There's L1, L2. I use those nice little connectors. We're going to do the same thing for A, B, and C. One, two, and three. Make it look nice, you know? Make it look nice. Make it look tits. Peter, yeah. did you take the little school bus to school and wear a, a rubber helmet on your head? Nope. Are you sure? Yep. Um, and I just gave you a raise, too. Yeah, I need, I need the Who does this, by the way? Look, how did you get the front cover of the coupling against the wall? You drilled a hole through it, didn't you? Yeah. Why? It, it comes with holes. Yeah, I didn't like it. See, this is this is the front, the front yeah. right? Not it doesn't go there. I think didn't, didn't have it, might work. Work. it might work. It might work to put that one on. There. No, it's not. But where's it going to screw into? It has holes. Yeah, but it's not going to uh, hold the hole yeah. into the holes. Yeah, I'm going to need uh, the five sixteen. See if it goes over. We'll, we'll put some long uh, galvanized screws through there. Maybe it'll we'll screw into the siding because. It's not, I don't think it's going to go into place. No. No, it's not. Yeah. Unscrew that, yeah, and you'll spin that whole thing out. I, just, I need a 516. Peter. Catch. I missed. Do it right in your hand, too. I know. Peter. Peter. Look at that. Let's go, Bosch. Let's go, Bosch. Let's go, Bosch. And I'm wearing it, too. Let's go, Bosch. Love it. Looking at, all, looking at all these Let's Go Bosch Pipe Doctor Summer 2022 short sleeve t-shirts, you'd think we'd be putting in a Bosch by now. But we're putting in a Fujitsu. Because I happen to like Fujitsu. They're very nice. Getting tech support on the, on, um, getting tech support from them on the phone is a real pain in the ass. Oops. Pain in the rear end. Trying to keep it rated PG for the folks over at Bosch Thermal Technology. Even though this is not really a Bosch video, but they're a corporate sponsor to the channel, so we have to give a huge shout out to Bosch. Let's go, Bosch! And you look, you're wearing a Bosch hat. I hate this hat. You should get a, a pipe doctor hat. You know the pipe they doctor don't hat? Fit. They, oh, because you have a small noggin. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because look at your. <laughs> and then I got that tan one from the attic, and I can make it fit. Which attic, which attic was that? Was that last week's Fujitsu you found that? No, it was the watch guy. The watch guy. Oh, the watch guy. He got the two Bosch IDS yeah. 2.0s. Yeah. The watch guy. Yeah. He was. He wore something special. He thought, he thought I was coming. Yeah. A titanium. AP? Titanium. Rolex? I don't no. know. No. One of my customers, he happens to like watches, like, kind of like I do. And um, he always wears a different piece when I come over, even though I'm wearing my eye watch. But one time, one time, I, ro I wore my Rolls Gold Sky Dweller to his house. <laughs> And he's like, what are you, nuts? You're wearing a $100,000 watch in your wrist to a service call. But I wore it just for him. So you know who I'm talking about if you're watching this video. Hi. All right, I didn't like how the process was taken with that. So right now I have the field piece, my vacuum pump hooked up right here. Right now we're testing the micron gauge, see how far down it goes. It should go down to like, I don't know, at least 20. Yeah, right there is good. All right, so she's dropping. We're good. Let's open this bad boy up and let's redo the vacuum process with the Blue Vac Plus Pro and the Field Piece vacuum pump. Oh, I just placed an over SupplyHouse.com. I should have ordered some more black gold. Oh, oh it's all right. With free shipping at SupplyHouse.com, real people, real service. Not a sponsor of the channel, but they do sponsor HeatingHelp.com. So you got to give them props for that, though. Air Force, none. N-U-N. <laughs> Good old Air Force, none. Using the N-A-V-A-C. Automatic flaring tool. How do you like that thing, Christian? It's nice. All right. Nice, almost done. And it's 1230. Oh, yeah. 
the finishing touches one handedly. Right before the rain, too. 115. Tits! We didn't have another flat elbow there, so for like for now, this is the way it is. But a nice liquid tight. It's nice. It's really nice. It's really nice. Not too shabby. Oh. Almost walked into a, a wall. We got one, two, and three in the other bedroom, and they're all draining very well. Someone's gonna comment on this, but. I guess we could take some three-quarter PVC and make a little tee up there and catch all of them and then drain down and across, but it's nice. When we come back to put that elbow on, it looks better than the house, right? <laughs> I know. But it's nice. It's a nice job. What do you say, Chris? Chris and Peter did the entire line set for that far one. Very nice. Nice job. Give yourself a pat in the back. There you go. Good job. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I get asked quite frequently by email, and they're like, Mikey Pipes, how do you do these systems so fast? Like, bro, we move with a purpose. <laughs> and we never, ever, ever cut any corners. I'd rather not do the job. I'd rather stay home if the job is not gonna be done right. Ain't that, ain't that right, Stoli? Stoli, ain't that right? Gigi, Gigi, is that right? Hey, I'm talking to you. Don't you know I'm talking to you? I guess not. <laughs> so thank you so much for tuning in. Hopefully I showed you guys how I like to use the uh, NAVAC automatic flaring tool i think it's awesome it's such a awesome device that saves so much time and you just make perfect tits flares every single time let me get your thoughts and feedback down in the comment section down below what do you think about the navac automatic flaring tool versus like the spin which one lucky viewer could win by sending me an email with why they deserve to have it all right guys be well god bless Stacey.